So sometimes I am a complete idiot. I just did this whole like three or four minute video and then realized as I was about to stop the video that I was on photo the whole time. Yep, sometimes not the sharpest knife in the drawer. Uh, I wanted to hop on quick. I read something on Facebook um, the other day and I thought, you know what? That describes my husband. And you know, most people, most people don't know Jeff, right? The, other than like what I post on Facebook and videos of ours and stuff. Um, so here's a little insight to my husband. This woman made this post and she said her husband doesn't buy her flowers. He doesn't buy her chocolates, but he doesn't make her fancy dinners, but he always pushes the grocery cart. He on Sunday mornings makes sure she's got her cup of coffee made just the way she likes ready for her. And I got thinking and I'm like, you know what? That's my husband. Jeff always pushes the shopping cart. Jeff always opens the car door for me. Jeff always makes sure when I'm there, he's always making sure I'm eating and drinking enough and, and just taking care of me. Um, making sure when it is hot there, he is making sure that the fan's working and the fan's on me. Um, he will put it on me before he puts it on himself. Uh, when I'm here and he's there, um, he asks me every day, did you have breakfast, honey? And then if I talk to him in the afternoon, did you have lunch? And sometimes it's yes, sometimes it's no. Today, I didn't have lunch till like two o'clock in the afternoon because I was insanely busy with work. And when I talk to him, he's like, did you eat lunch? And I'm like, no, I didn't, but I'll have an early supper. So, um, but he is always making sure because he loves to take care of me. And so he is always making sure I'm taken care of or that I'm taking care of myself when he's not there to take care of me. Do I have something on my eye? Of course I do because like I'm doing a video. So that would be the exact same time you would have something on your eye, right? Um, so when I finished my other video, I went and I got the roundup. I had a whole bunch of roundup I needed to spray. I've got weeds coming up through my brick and like, I just, I needed to clean it up. Um, I am completely capable of doing that. I don't want to do that. Um, I want my husband to do that. Um, and you know what, when he gets here, he will gladly do that for me. And, and I know that. And I my brother always gets super frustrated with me because I'll say like, oh, I, I need Jeff here to do this stuff. And I'm like, that's a man's job. And he'll say, it is not. And he's like, do not be teaching my my kids that because I have my niece and nephew a lot. And I love that. And, and he's 100% right. And I've always taught my kids that they are capable of doing whatever they want. They're 100% capable. Um, but, and you know what? When I was like 20, I would have never said, well, I need a man to do that. I would have been in there like a dirty shirt doing it myself, but I'm not 20 anymore. And there's certain jobs I just don't want to do. And I know that if Jeff was here, he'd gladly do them for me. So that's just another reason why I need him to be able to get his butt into Canada. Um, yeah. So, but anyways, I just wanted to share that, you know, that's the kind of husband I have. Um, when my brother said he saw that picture and he just realized like I'd never been happier, he's right. I have I have never been happier with anybody. And relationships are work and you have to make a conscious effort when you get up every day that you are going to put effort into your relationship, whether you're married or not. And, and it's work. And Jeff and I put a lot of effort into our relationship because we're so far. We have to. Um, if we didn't, then, um, you know, we'd fall apart. And I'm not going to say it's all roses because it's not because we fight. We fight. Actually, it's more, like, I'll be honest, it's it's more me that fights. Jeff usually will just say, well, well, maybe, you know, we should have a better chat tomorrow. And I'll be like, nah. So, but he's not perfect. He fights too. So, but yeah, if I'm honest, most of the time it's, it's me giving a go at him. Um, because long distance is hard. And I always find the longer we're away from each other, the, the, uh, more upset I get and then I'm then I fight um, but we put that effort in every single day Jeff gives me a hundred percent of himself and I am so lucky even though you know our situation is not perfect right now I know that someday it will be and that is enough because um, I've never had that I've never had anybody 
who wants to take care of me, who wants to make sure that I'm okay every day. I've never had that. Um, so yeah, I, I'm really lucky. I, I have a pretty amazing husband. So anyways, I just want to share that.